Hello, everyone. I am Naoko Yamazaki, a Japanese astronaut. I flew to the International Space Station in 2010 on Space Shuttle Discovery. Since then, I've dedicated myself to the education for the next generations like you. So I am so happy to receive various questions from you. Let me answer each of them. First question is from Kairos. My name is Kairos and, and I am seven years old. I study in UP Integrated School. I hope you're interested in asteroids, planets, and other things in space because I have a question for you. What do you eat in space? What do you eat in space? There are more than 300 menus of space food. Most of them are freeze dry so that they can reduce their weight to launch and they can be preserved for a long time. But some space food are like、uh, Carrios too in a pouch. Or even we have some canned fruits. And you can have some snacks as well, like chocolates and cookies. So you will enjoy it. Next question is Malaya. I am Malaya Balcueva and I am six years old and I like some astronaut videos that I watch. I have some questions for you. One, how does sunrise and sunset look in space? Also, How does the Northern Lights look in space? Number two. What is your job exactly in space? Number three. How do you sleep in space? And finally, question number four. What's your favorite food and do you miss it while in space or no? How does sunrise and sunset look in space? Well, it's beautiful. Because the ISS rotates around the Earth 16 times a day. It rotates around the Earth every 90, 90 minutes. So every 45 minutes, we have daylight. And the next 45 minutes, we have、uh, night. And we repeat it 16 times. And at the moment of the sunrise and the sunset, the space is dark. But the Earth is still dark. But the layer of the atmosphere, which is very thin, is lit by the sunrise. And it's so miracle. They write in a rainbow colors and they are so thin, like a skin on the apple. So you will be inspired and you will be impressed. The next one is how does northern lights look in space? Yes, northern lights is. Another my favorite scene from space.、Uh, they are dynamic and they move so dynamically. And、uh, we can see green lights and also the pink and red and orange lights as well. So you enjoy it. And how do you sleep in space? We sleep in a sleeping bag and attached to the wall. In microgravity, We can sleep anywhere on the ground. We usually sleep on the floor or on a bed, right? But we can sleep on the wall or we can sleep even on the ceiling. So, even though the spacecraft is small, we can utilize the inside widely. And sleeping in microgravity is fun to me.、You've It's like you know, floating, and it's like you know, you will sleep in like in water, so it's so much fun. And what's your favorite food, and do you miss it while in space or no? Well, I love ice cream, but in space, of course, there are refrigerator or freezer for the experiments, but there are no refrigerator for food. So we usually cannot eat ice cream in space. I missed it a lot. Next question is Arabella. I'm Arabella f e l i c i a n I'm six years old. I have three questions to ask you. So the first question is What is your favorite Japanese food that you wish 
to eat in space. Now, question number two: What do you like to do in the space station? And question number three: What will happen if you get sucked in a black hole? One day, I think I want to be an astronaut just like you. So, hope you have a safe trip. Bye. What is your favorite Japanese food? Yes, we have some Japanese space food as well. My favorite one was curry, because in space, in microgravity conditions, we have a fluid shift, so we have lots of water in your head and face. So somehow, like you have some,、uh, you have a cold, and you have a running nose. Your sense of taste gets dull, right? It's exactly the same in space. So I prefer spicy food or strong taste food in space, like curry. And what do you like to do in the space station? First of all, I really enjoyed watching the Earth from, from the International Space Station, like this background picture. This view was taken from Cupra, a dome-shaped window attached to the ISS, and、uh, you will enjoy it. And of course, in the microgravity itself, it's so enjoyable. You can make many somersaults. So I hope you will enjoy microgravity someday in space. And what will happen if you get into a black hole? Wow,、well, good question. I don't know. So、uh, you will keep studying, and please let me know when you discover. Some researchers mention probably our bodies get extended like a spaghetti, or you, you will you know get into another universe or so. But nobody knows the answer yet. So I hope you will discover it someday.